so glad you're here. Come with me, I'm getting ready to meet and sing with our bug friends. It's so fun when we all get to sing together, come on. Hooray, we're all together. Hi you guys, I think we're ready to sing. Jump up, here we go. You can dance too, ready? Okay, a little bit faster. Are you ready? A little bit faster. You guys, even faster. Are you ready? So fast. Bunny, what's wrong? Oh, friends, Bible Bunny is upset. He can't find his Bible, it's missing. He thinks it's lost. Bible Bunny, are you sure you don't know where it is? Oh, oh no. Friends, how will Bible Bunny be able to share his Bible words with us today? How will we know what God wants to say to us today? Friends, want to help Bible Bunny look for his Bible? You do? Great! Okay, Bible Bunny, let's check all the places you've been. Where were you? Okay, okay, come on, friends. Let's go walk to our favorite Bible story spot. That's where Bible Bunny just came from. Let's go! Okay, Bible Bunny, let's see. We're here. Boys and girls, do you see Bible Bunny's Bible anywhere? There it is! You found it! Bible Bunny, there's your Bible! Great job, boys and girls, and just in time! I'm about to share a Bible story with you, and guess what? It's about someone else who lost their Bible, and they were so happy when they found it. Bible Bunny, would you like to stay and listen to our true story with us? You would? Okay, great. You guys fasten your seatbelt. Click, good job. Put on your listening ears. We're ready. Here we go. Hello, boys and girls. How are you today? My name is King Josiah. Can I tell you a story today? Well, it was a long, long time ago. I think I was about maybe eight years old. Yeah, I was eight years old, but I wanted to be a good king and I wanted to help God's people know to go love and obey him. I did what was right in the eyes of God. I taught the people all about God. He is so good and I made them stop doing bad things and only to worship God. It was time to fix the temple, or as you call it, the church. It had been broken and it was a mess. We worked and worked and worked. Pretend with me, boys and girls. Help me fix the temple. Let's saw and hammer and paint. Well, one day while we were fixing the wall, somebody found something that was hidden. They pulled it out and what was it? It was the book of the law of God, the Bible. Yay, we found it and we read it. We read about how big and how wonderful God is. We read about how God made us and how much he loves us. 
And God loves us so much. I wanted us to all obey him. I told God's people that we would start doing what the book of the law said to do. And God's people said, okay. We will start to do what the book of the law says to do and to obey our loving God because the Bible teaches us what is right. Today, you call the book of the law the Bible. You can read the Bible too, just like I did. When you read your Bible, you will know how much God loves you and what God wants you to do too. Because the Bible teaches us what is right, will you read your Bible every day with your mom and dad? Okay, bye boys and girls. Bible Bunny, King Josiah was so excited to find his Bible, just like you. We would love for you to share Bible words with us. Now that you found your Bible, would you like to sing your favorite song with us? You would? Okay, Bible Bunny's gonna sing with us, so let's get bouncy. Can you get bouncy? Okay, we're ready. Here we go. The B-I-B-L-E, yes, that's the book for me. I stand alone on the Word of God, the B-I-B-L-E Bible! <gasps> awesome! I'm so excited to hear God talk with us. I can't wait to hear what you have to say. Are you ready, boys and girls? Get your listening ears on. Okay, good job. Okay, Bible buddy, we're ready. Boys and girls, wait till you hear what God wants to say to you. Are you ready? It's from Philippians 2, 4. Shh, are you listening? Okay, God says, look out for the good of others. <gasps> hey, that's what King Josiah did, isn't it? Yeah, he knew how important it was for others to know all about God. He really loved God and God's law, the Bible, because the Bible taught him how much God loves him. And the Bible taught him how to live God's way which is awesome because God's way is the right way. <gasps> do you want to sing our Bible words with me? Okay, do you want to listen to us sing Bible words? You do? Okay, here we go. Look out for the good of others, good of others, good of others. Look out for the good of others. Philippians 2, 4. Wasn't that fun? Okay, wait, we have to sing it clapping, so jump up and clap your hands, okay? He'll, Bible Bunny will clap his hands and let's sing together, okay? All right, here we go. Look out for the good of others, good of others, good of others. Look out for the good of others, Philippians 2, 4. Wow, it's true. The more we know God, the more we love him. Just like King Josiah, isn't that right? Yeah. And the more we love him, the more we will want to follow him, just like King Josiah, right? Yeah. I'm so glad we can read our Bible. The Bible teaches us what's right. Boys and girls, Bible Bunny wants to know what we learn when we read the Bible. I think me and you can teach Bible Bunny. Would you like to do that with me? You would? Okay, great, so put on your thinking caps and come with me to our favorite spot so we can answer all our questions for Bible Bunny. Here we go. Okay, friends, I need your help. We're gonna help Bible Bunny learn what he learns when he reads his Bible, okay? Are your listening ears on? Let's see if you can answer my questions. So. Who talks to us when we read the Bible? Yes, God talks to us. He does. And who loves us? Yes, God loves us. That's what we learn when we read our Bible. And who wants to teach us the right way to live? Yes, God does. Good job. Did you get that Bible, Bunny? When we read our Bible, we learn all those things. We learn to live the right way.
good job. Bible Bunny, did that help you? It did. Oh, good. Good job, friends. You helped Bible Bunny. And we're so glad you found your Bible. Thanks for visiting with us, and we'll see you next time. Bye, Bible Bunny. This reminds me of a song. Because the more we read the Bible, the more we learn about God and how much God loves us. And our love grows and grows and grows. <gasps> Let's sing. If you neglect your Bible, forget to pray, forget to pray, forget to pray. If you neglect your Bible, forget to pray, then you'll shrink, shrink, shrink. Then you'll shrink, shrink, shrink. Then you'll shrink, shrink. If you neglect your Bible, forget to pray, then you'll shrink, shrink, shrink. One, two, three, four. But if you read your Bible, pray every day, pray every day, pray every day. If you read your Bible, pray every day, then you'll grow, grow, grow. Let's talk to God before we go. Let's be very quiet. Let's be very quiet. We fold our hands and bow our heads and pray to God. Dear God, thank you for giving us the Bible so we can learn more and more about you and about how much you love us. Help us share the stories with all our friends and family because it's true. The Bible teaches us what's right. Amen. I'm so glad we got to spend time together singing and learning and helping Bible Bunny. I'll see you next time. And remember, the Bible teaches us what's right. Bye, boys and girls. <laughs>